at Oracle Arena. <laughs> well, do you enjoy sipping champagne at the salon? Thousands of beauty salons and barber shops are serving alcohol illegally in California, but a new bill would allow those businesses to serve without a liquor license. Opponents call it a dangerous deregulation of alcohol. ABC 7 News reporter Katie Udis investigated the issue. Buzzed at the barber shop? Sloshed at the salon? That's a concern, says alcohol industry watchdog Bruce Lee Livingston. This is one of the stupidest and most dangerous bills I've seen in a long time. State Assembly Bill 1322 would allow beauty salons and barber shops to serve beer and wine without a liquor license. I think thousands of businesses uh, throughout California are, uh, are doing this. Assemblymember Tom Daly represents District 69, Santa Ana, Anaheim, Garden Grove, and Orange. A salon owner brought the issue to him after she received a warning from the Department of Alcoholic Beverage Control for serving. Madhu Salon in San Francisco got the same message. It came as a shock to us because other local businesses in the area um, would offer wine or um, some form of alcoholic beverage to their guests. It's technically illegal. So the, the regulations need to be modernized to reflect the modern times that we're in. This Bay Area barber agrees. He serves, but asks that we not name his business because he thought he was operating within the rules. It's just a nice way to, like, like thank your clients for coming in, give them something to kind of relax them. There are so many salons on this one city block near Union Square that it's almost impossible to say how many serve statewide because it's all off the books. But of the 10 salon owners that I spoke with, four don't serve at all, three serve regularly, and three serve on occasion. AB 1322 could legalize the practice for more than 20,000 businesses, and that's a conservative estimate from Daly's office. This is a massive increase in the number of places in California where um, alcohol could be served. For Livingston, it's a matter of safety because business owners would not be required to obtain a liquor license. Anybody who's licensed in these barbershops or beauty salons can pour the liquor, but they're not trained. The bill limits each customer to a single serving of alcohol that must be free. People we spoke with like the idea of a sip and a snip. And it's kind of loosening up the mood. No more than 12 ounces of beer or six ounces of wine by the glass. You're not a bar. They're not coming in here to get twisted. A drink can only be provided during business hours and no later than 10 at night. The salon licensee who's serving would be responsible for making sure people are over 21 and not over-served. There is liability for uh, these places. In San Francisco, Katie Udis, ABC 7 News. If the bill passes the Senate, it could be on the governor's desk by this fall. Advocates at Alcohol Justice want people who are opposed to send letters to Sacramento.